It is consolation for all the women who have ever squeezed themselves into a Spanx, and you know who we are. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah. there's a version now. For guys, too, it's called the Man Girdle or the Myrtle. And we heard about it because of mm -hmm. a... <laughs> You're all, you know, cool, yeah, cool. sorry you dropped in today, mm -hmm. are you, David? Anyway, the story first appeared on my hometown, Louisville Station, WHAS 11, and here with the skinny on it all is WHAS reporter Don Hudson. Meet Frank Stamper. He's an editor here at WHAS and a 201-pound volunteer model. Frank's normal waistline is 36 inches, but today he's trying on a body shaping compression garment. And now with it on. And that has made his waist a dainty 34 and one quarter inch. This is a question that we never like to ask, but we must ask in this case. How did it feel? It was tight. Oh. But I mean there was no discomfort. It was I mean it was tight around here. The waistline was great. I mean it, there really was no discomfort. I mean, you could walk around for a full day of work and nobody would probably know that you have the right. body shaper on. Well, getting the tummy tucking tank top on was not easy over a t-shirt. Oh. Frank is now sold on the compression concept. Lost two inches. I mean, where can you go in 30 seconds and lose two inches? Well, the answer to that is the internet. Website after website now sells waist eliminators, chest compressors, myrtles and man's ears. They go by several different names, but in the end, they're just girdles for guys. They aim to help hide muffin top, love handles, moves, man cans, or whatever name you give the fatty areas of your torso. And according to underworks.com, business is very, very good, and customers are very, very happy. But that shouldn't really come as a surprise. We all remember how happy Frank Costanza was with his newfound support when he and Kramer came up with the man's ear. Frank didn't dance, but he did want to take the body sculpting tank top home when we were done. I mean, I was impressed with a t-shirt on. You couldn't tell that you had it on. Yeah. It was like you just had a normal t-shirt underneath of it and you put your shirt on top of it. So nobody knows. It's like you said, if they had the little fake abs with it, maybe then. <laughs> because you're totally going to call me on it. You'll feel that there are no abs, right? It's just displaced. <laughs> yes, but we all know the moment when someone just comes up and puts their arm accidentally oh. on your midriff, and you wish you had sucked and straightened and gotten out. So there it is. It's the would answer. you wear, not that you need it, but would you wear something like this? <laughs> you don't need it at all. Well, you know, are you asking yeah. me to do that now? Because <laughs> it's not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs>